what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? After protests broke out on Friday throughout the Detroit area due to an officer involved shooting, the police chief released a graphic video of a 20 year old man being gunned down by his officers. According to the Popos, 20 year old Darnell Sylvester was wanted on federal drug charges. He gave himself up without incident. Hakeem Littleton, also 20, was standing next to him. Hakeem pulled out a gun and started shooting. He got off four shots before he was fatally shot by at least three officers. Someone reported to the police that Hakeem said that he was not going to be arrested by the police. And he made good on that promise. I wonder did he anticipate being murdered by the police? That's pretty much the option when you pull out a gun and several cops have you surrounded. Yeah, he was tired of living. There's, there's no way possible he thought he was going to escape that situation. I mean, he pulled out a gun and he missed. This is why I say, fam, you know, you got to, if you're going to carry a, a gun, get some training. The cop was point blank, standing right next to him, and he missed. I mean, he missed like point blank range. And he shot four times. Anyway, the people were protesting prior to the video being released. Now, some people say, you know, they look for these type of situations like, oh, you see that? You can't believe everything you hear. You see that? You know, look, I thought I saw, and maybe you guys can correct me, but I thought I saw one of those cops shoot him point blank after he was already stiff. You know, he like walked right up to him, boom, like right in the head. I thought I saw that. But... The way dude went down, I don't know, fam. I don't know. It looks like to me, it looked like to me, like after he was down, uh, you know, they could have just made the arrest. But he was probably, he was already dead. In my opinion, he was already stiff. So, and dude popped on him. But you know how the police do it. They typically don't release that footage that fast unless they know for sure they're in the right. Like, they're usually holding on to the footage because they're probably doctoring it. Cutting, pasting, you know, editing, modifying. <laughs> you know, they'll hold on to that footage. They'll hold on to that footage for dear life if they feel they're wrong. But usually, when they give it up real, real fast, they're pretty much sure that they got a slam dunk. And you better believe that they make sure. That, I, I, I can guarantee you they have some type of quality control. I know that's an oxymoron when it comes to police in the United States. But they got somebody who probably view those videos to make sure before they release them that they can give the officer a pass. I'm almost certain that that person exists. Anyway, R.I.P. Hakeem Littleton. Family, don't try this at home. No more talk. What, what the ladies talking about? Yeah.